Welcome to Reality Scoop. Please, can you take the time to subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell and the like button. It's free for you, but means the world to us. Thank you. Now on with our video. Are you ready to embark on a journey that will tantalize your taste buds, ignite your culinary creativity, and awaken your senses to a world of vibrant flavors? Look no further, because you've just stepped into the aromatic realm of Spice Guys. At Spice Guys, we believe that every dish is an opportunity for culinary artistry. Our passion for exquisite flavors, coupled with the art of seasoning, has led us to curate a remarkable collection of handcrafted blends that will revolutionize your cooking experience. Whether you're a seasoned chef or a home cooking enthusiast, our premium spices are your ticket to transforming ordinary meals into extraordinary gastronomic adventures, so, come on in, spice enthusiast. The world of flavor awaits, and we're here to guide you every step of the way. Imagine a quaint, peaceful village nestled in the misty hills of Landui Brefi. But beneath this serene facade, a sinister force lurks. The shadow of Landui. This isn't your average tale of ghostly apparitions. This is a story of an entity, ancient and malevolent, that has haunted these lands for centuries. Its origins are buried deep in the past, shrouded in mystery. Some say it was a spirit cursed by a dark sorcerer, bound to the village and doomed to wander eternally. The very mention of its name sends a chill down the spine. For its presence brings with it a chilling aura of fear and despair. Those who cross its path are plagued by nightmares and visions of unspeakable horror, their sanity whittled away by the relentless torment of the vengeful spirit. As dusk falls, the village folk retreat to their homes, for they know the shadow of Landui stirs. The shadow's presence pervades every corner of the village, casting a chilling pall of fear and despair. In the heart of Landui Brefi, a spectre of dread lingers. The villagers, once jovial and full of life, now live in the icy grip of fear. Their nights are filled with terrifying dreams, their days haunted by visions of unspeakable horror. This is not the work of mere imagination. It is the malevolent handiwork of the shadow, an entity bound to their village by the dark strands of an ancient curse. Each villager has a tale to tell, stories of nightmares that seem all too real, of visions that blur the line between reality and the macabre. The blacksmith speaks of dreams where his forge becomes a pit of writhing shadows. The innkeeper's daughter tells of visions where the cider in her jug turns to blood. And the old widow at the edge of the village, her eyes speak volumes of the torment she endures, her sanity slowly crumbling under the shadow's relentless assault. The shadow doesn't confine its terror to the realm of dreams and visions. It makes its presence known in the physical world too. Some villagers claim to have seen its form, an amorphous entity, darker than the deepest night, lurking in the corners of their vision. Its eyes, they say, glow with a malevolent light that chills the soul. Its mere presence induces a feeling of dread that lingers long after it has disappeared. The villagers, united by their shared fear, have tried time and time again to banish the spirit. They've sought the help of priests and witches, performed rituals and offered prayers. But their efforts have been in vain. The shadow's grip on their village remains unyielding, a constant reminder of its power and the dark forces that bind it to Landewi Brefi. The villagers, trapped in this relentless torment, have tried to banish the spirit, but to no avail. Despite their best efforts, the grip of the shadow on Landui Brefe remains unyielding. This is the harsh reality that the villagers have come to accept. Over the years, they've thrown everything they've got at this spectral menace, from local folk remedies to the most potent of exorcisms. Yet, the shadow persists laughing in the face of their struggles and deepening the despair that hangs over the village. The villagers recount tales of their failed attempts to banish the shadow, each new story more heartbreaking 
than the last. From the old priest who, it is said, battled the entity in a night-long exorcism, only to be found the next morning, his spirit broken, his sanity shattered. To the brave group of villagers who ventured into the heart of the hills, armed with ancient talismans and a burning desire to free their home from the curse, they returned defeated, their eyes haunted by the terror they had witnessed. These stories are shared in hushed whispers, serving as grim reminders of the power of the shadow. They are tales of resilience and courage, yes, but also of despair and defeat. They serve to underline the fact that the curse is not just a tale spun by the elders to scare young ones. It is real, tangible, and unyielding. And so, the curse has become a constant reminder of the dark forces lurking beneath the peaceful surface of the village. It has woven itself into the fabric of everyday life, casting long, foreboding shadows where there should be light. It is in the wistful sigh of the wind, the mournful cry of the night owl, the eerie silence that descends upon the village at twilight. It is everywhere, and it is inescapable. The shadow of Landui, a malevolent entity bound by ancient magic, continues to haunt the mist-shrouded hills, its reign of fear unbroken. It stands as a testament to the unseen forces that exist in our world. The ones that lurk in the shadows, waiting for the perfect moment to strike. The ones that, despite our best efforts, refuse to be banished to the realms of myth and legend. I hope you enjoyed the video, we at Reality Scoop enjoyed making it for you. Please give this video a thumbs up as this really does help us out a lot. Also if you like our content please consider subscribing and turning on that notification bell to be made aware of our next upload, by subscribing to the channel it really does help us out, plus it's free for you to do. Thank you and I hope to see you on the next video. Bye for now.